Hey, it's Brad Butler here, uh, Executive Director and Curator at Main Street Arts. And I uh, wanted to give you a little walkthrough of our main floor exhibition uh, today. Uh, solo exhibition by Chad Groman called Up To Now. Uh, this show is um, sort of a retrospective, uh, highlighting work from the last well, about 10 years or so uh, that Chad has done in a variety of styles and uh, materials. So I just wanted to show you some of my favorite pieces in the show and also just kind of give you a chance to to see the see the exhibition. Well, the first thing I'll say about this exhibition is it is one of the first that we have installed and shown in the new interactive format um, and that really made me think about installing the exhibition a little differently than I had in the past uh, with any other show. Uh, normally I think about how people interact with an exhibition uh, from their, their point of entry uh, through the front door. But this time, uh, the exhibition actually starts with the screen you're seeing right here. Um, so I thought about, you know, how, how people are interacting with this online, and uh, that kind of started the way that I, I got to hang in the exhibition. So I'll just give you a little walk through this wall here. And uh, as you can tell, there's a wide range of work in this exhibition. Um, some of his cutout pieces, uh, a few digital pieces, uh, a lot of, of paintings uh, with gouache on paper. Um, some of the work in the show, I think just a couple pieces, uh, were actually included in previous exhibitions at Maestri Art, which is kind of interesting. Uh, this one here is called Always Home. And this was actually included in a solo exhibition that Chad had uh, upstairs at Main Street Arts in 2014. Uh, and that is one of my, one of my favorites of his, uh, it really blends his, you know, stylized um, view of nature with his unique brush marks. Um, and it's also, um, it's weird, it's surreal. Uh, you know, there's this person, house, hybrid. Another interesting part of the exhibition is uh, this group of posters here. These are all posters for um, concerts at uh, the Fillmore in San Francisco, California. Uh, and Chad has had a relationship with them uh, over the last several years uh, and has been fortunate to uh, make posters for some great bands. And uh, some of these are done digitally, some of them are done mixed media, some are just paintings, and then um, from there they go, uh, all of them ultimately end up being put onto the computer to, uh, to make the poster. Chad's wife, Kristen, is often the model uh, for Chad and his paintings. Here uh, she is at one of their favorite restaurants in Buffalo, Amy's Place. And uh, together they put out this magazine called Reciprocal Roots. Um, that's a cover. Uh, Chad had a short run as a tattoo artist. So some of the work included in the show is actually Tattoo Flash. Um, he was a tattoo artist at Divine Machine Tattoo in Buffalo. These are a few of the tattoo-inspired pieces in the exhibition. And it's really interesting to see uh, Chad's work from this time and um, adapting to the, the necessities of being a tattoo artist and working on skin, and then seeing how that impacted his paintings uh, from that, after that point. 